clocked at speeds of 200 kilometers per hour on a slippery dirt surface. These off-roaders will wow just about anyone. An action-packed weekend commencing tomorrow near Griffith. And there's two locals in with a real chance of taking out stage two in the ARB Australian off-road racing series. Matt Ryan is a local here and does a lot with our club. He, uh, he was lucky enough to navigate and win the first round. So uh, he'll be looking for another strong um, performance this week, along with his brother Andy. The terrain at Stackpool, located 45 minutes from the city, set to be a major challenge for all participating racing teams. Out there at Stackpool there's a lot of rocks and a lot of hilly country where the cars have to drive over the hills and back around. The Ryan brothers will be granted a home circuit advantage which could prove beneficial in securing a stage two open class win. It's a team event between the driver and the navigator. Um, being on, your, on their home property will definitely help them, but it is a, um, a lot of factors going to have, having a fast car and a fast team. It's not just extreme racing the off-road series brings to the region. There's also a huge economic spin-off with more than 86 drivers, not including team and family members, flocking to the city. All those people are going to come through town and stop at fuel stations. They're going to stop at um, food outlets and buy food. They're going to buy their groceries and stuff like that. So as far as economics, I think it's a pretty big boom for Griffith. If you'd like more information on the series, follow the link. Dean Foscarini, Win News.